Ash United TV joined by women's manager Chris Brooks after the 90-0 victory against Celebrity Celtic. Chris, your thoughts on that game? It was good, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> um, but we, we had a game plan and we stuck to it and it, and it paid off. We rotated the team quite a lot to give everyone minutes in pre-season. That's what it's all about. Uh, make sure we're all ready for the start of the season in the Greater Manchester Women's League. At 19 is it difficult to pick out a key player, a sort of a, a player of the match sort of thing? To be honest, it's, it's always difficult picking out a key player because they, they all play so well together and it's always good when you've got your bench just as strong as your starting 11. Um, the problem I have is keeping everybody happy, keeping everyone playing. That's, that's the only problem I have. How good was it to play at Hurst Cross, at the, at the ground with so many fans here? It was such a, a great turnout from the Robins fans. Uh, I love it. I mean, I'm, I'm Hurst Cross through and through myself. Uh, I used to live on Surrey Street, used to play for Ashton United, ball boy idea, watch the games. Uh, and to be on this side, on the pitch with the girls, it's, it's been fantastic. I love it. Going forward, obviously, pre-season, it is about, about building fitness and, and building, building tactics. Not necessarily about the result, but it's good to win and 19 nil it is it's got to be a good feeling it's always good always good to win um we've got some we've got some more games coming up that wouldn't wouldn't be as um wouldn't be as easy for us uh salford wivenshaw uh, a lot higher up in the tier system than we are but we're going to give it our all and uh like i say i need to find weaknesses so we need to play them sort of teams to find the weaknesses to work on